In the past couple of years, Tesla has been shifting its focus from manufacturing just electric cars. Tesla is also going to build transport vehicles and trucks. In this video, we take a look at the new Tesla truck. Stay tuned and watch. Before we begin, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Turn on the bell for the latest notifications and updates. With that said, let's dig right into today's content. In May 2020, Elon Musk announced Tesla would be moving its headquarters to Austin, Texas. By December 2021, Tesla completed the move to the new Texas Gigafactory. Tesla plans to build the Model Y in Gigafactory, Texas. However, Tesla will also manufacture the Tesla Model 3, Cybertruck, and the Semi-Truck. Speaking of the Tesla Cybertruck, it's set to revolutionize the truck industry. It's going to have tons of seating and cargo space. But storage isn't the only good thing about the Cybertruck. Elon proposed a smaller Cybertruck for markets outside the US. However, those Cybertrucks won't be manufactured in the US. Rather, Tesla would manufacture these Cybertrucks in the Berlin Gigafactory. As of January 2022, the demand for the Tesla Cybertruck is approximately over a million units, which is believed to be worth nearly $80 billion. There is no doubt that a lot of people are awaiting the release of this electric pickup truck. It will be pretty challenging to get one if you don't have an order in already with the Tesla boss claiming that the company has so many orders, it might take three years to get through them all. During an interview with the Tesla Owners Club of Silicon Valley, Musk confirmed that the Tesla Cybertruck design is now finalized and ready for production. He said, we need to get on there, getting the Cybertruck to production. At least the design is finally locked. We got too carried away with the design updates. Apart from the fact that the company got too carried away with the Tesla Cybertruck's features, which led to delays in finalizing the vehicle's design and production, they also had other issues. The Tesla boss stated that if the Tesla Cybertruck had entered production last year, it wouldn't have mattered. The supply issues would have hurt its production. He also said having the Tesla Cybertruck in production along with other vehicles would have been an example of a rob one pocket to pay the other. According to Musk, another reason he pushed back the launch of the Tesla Cybertruck was that he feared the vehicle could flop due to the design being so unlike anything else. It didn't help that this electric pickup truck from Tesla would compete with electric pickup trucks from rival companies that would be in the market long before it. Elon Musk has been relatively quiet about the new Tesla Cybertruck updates. Some of these new changes possibly came about as a result of the increasing number of electric trucks that are either on the market or coming to the market. Many automakers have already been influenced by the Tesla Cybertruck's design and proposed technology. This means that the electric truck class as a whole is becoming very competitive. That said, the Tesla Cybertruck still retains its original futuristic sci-fi look. Musk also confirmed that the electric pickup truck would come with side mirrors, something required by law in the US and several other countries. However, he claimed that those mirrors are designed to be easy to remove. Elon Musk also previously disclosed that Tesla added rear wheel steering to the Cybertruck amongst other slight design changes. The Cybertruck has also been seen with a huge windshield wiper with only a single blade for the whole front of the truck. This is quite surprising, considering the windshield size. However, Musk confirmed that this particular feature is not final yet. According to recent pictures, the windshield wipers, while still huge, may also be extendable. This means it can wipe the whole windshield in one motion without being overly cumbersome when it's not in use. Elon also bragged about the strength of the Cybertruck when it was first announced, even showcasing how it coped against a sledgehammer. The Cybertruck's key selling point, however, is the steel exoskeleton, which the company claims is made of 30 times cold rolled stainless steel, which is allegedly the hardest thing Tesla could find. The Cybertruck will be taking a different stance on its materials, being the cool non-conformist vehicle it is. The Tesla Cybertruck will come with the new 4680 battery cells. Tesla promises that the spiral design offers 16 more range and 6 times the power of its existing battery cells. These battery cells are also supposed to cost less to produce, and those savings can be seen in the final cost of the truck. Speaking of the final cost of the Cybertruck, Tesla wants to make the electric pickup truck affordable. Initially, it had a starting price of nearly $40,000 when it was announced in 2019. 
The Cybertruck is now set to start at $39,990, while the dual motor model complete with all-wheel drive was set to be worth $49,990. The tri-motor Cybertruck is set to start at $69,990. However, the newly announced quad-motor model's pricing is still unknown. All four models will come with basic autopilot as standard and the full self-driving option for an additional fee of $12,000. The Tesla Cybertruck is nearly upon us and it's only a year and a half before we see the Tesla Cybertruck on the roads. That's all for today's video. Hope you enjoyed watching this one. Thanks for watching.